The United States Senate Committee on Veterans Affairs deals with oversight of United States veterans' issues. Description It was created in 1970 to transfer responsibilities for veterans from the Finance and Labor Committees to a single panel. From 1947 to 1970, matters relating to veterans' compensation and veterans generally were referred to the Committee on Finance, while matters relating to the vocational rehabilitation, education, medical care, civil relief, and civilian readjustment of veterans were referred to the Committee on Labor and Public Welfare. Congressional legislation affecting veterans changed over the years. For the members of the armed forces and their families in the nation's early wars, the Revolutionary War, the War of 1812, the Mexican War, the Civil War and the Spanish–American War, the response of the federal government had been essentially financial. This was clearly the legislative mission of the Senate Committee on Pensions which was created as one of the Senate's original standing committees in 1816 and continued until its termination in the Legislative Reorganization Act of 1946. During World War I the nature of the congressional response to veterans' needs changed towards a more diversified set of programs. A war risk insurance program, which was referred to the Senate Finance Committee, changed the consideration of veterans' benefits in the Senate. The Finance Committee was the Senate Standing Committee most responsible for veterans' programs from 1917 to 1946. After World War II, the Finance Committee handled the Servicemen's Readjustment Act of 1944, the Gee Bill of Rights, which extended to servicemen and their families, a number of benefits including unemployment assistance, education, vocational training, housing and business loan guarantees, as well as the traditional medical and pension benefits of previous times. Many experts believe this law was one of the most important elements in the expansion of the middle class following World War II. The Veterans Affairs Committee had nine members in its initial Congress, the 92nd Congress (1971–73). It now has a total of 15 members. Topic: <laughs> Members, 115th Congress. According to committee members' official online biographies, three of the fourteen members are veterans, Richard Blumenthal, Dan Sullivan and Johnny Isaacson. <laughs> Previous Congresses <laughs> Members, 110th Congress Topic Members, one hundred eleventh Congress Source, two thousand nine Congressional Record, Volume one hundred fifty five, page S five one six eight and twenty ten Congressional Record, Volume one hundred fifty six, page S nine hundred seventy. Topic Members, one hundred twelfth Congress Source, 2011 Congressional Record, Vol. 157, page S557. Members, 113th Congress Source, 2013 Congressional Record, Vol. 159, page S296-297. Topic Members, one hundred fourteenth Congress. Source Topic Chairman of the Senate Committee on Veterans Affairs, nineteen seventy one present. Topic See also List of current United States Senate Committees United States House Committee on Veterans Affairs United States Department of Veterans Affairs <laughs>